I'm uh, Dr. Roy Arnold Lebone Chavez. I'm 26 years old. I'm a physician actually working at a extreme poverty place called Acos Vinches. ICL gave me the tools to understand how to put all of the knowledge into action. And, you know, just taking action, inspire and motivate others is what ICL taught me. And I'm so grateful for it. Now I come from Puno, which is a, a small city in Peru, the level of poverty extreme poverty data that um, describes the town it's it was a hard it was hard to live in you research uh, about you know Peru and other developing countries you can realize that reality is quite different from abroad when we were growing up my mother was a nurse and my father was a biologist so I would pass most of my time at the hospital actually my mom passed away it was a, a big struggle because we knew that that uh, misdiagnosis, like they saw that she has a cardiac pathology and, and they gave her something, some drug. And the fact that she passed away in the medical, in, in the medical uh, service, I started to think, okay, um, there are two options for me, you know. One, I could feel like um, really mad at the physician. I could feel that, you know, I should get a revenge. And the other option for me was, you know what, I should become a doctor. If it's a problem because of the education or the the way that a uh, professional was or received education or the knowledge, you know, it's it's a different formation. I didn't know what was happening. I didn't know what was going on or why he committed that mistake. But if that was the issue, then I should become a doctor or a physician that is capable to solve all the issues and to provide a really a good service to my community because they do deserve a high quality service. The Institute of Civic Leadership helped me I built this pathway to to reach my dreams, to reach my goals. It helped me to to construct and to take all of my values, passions, uh, talents, everything, and put it into uh, a future leader, a, a leader that can truly create change and truly can take action. And I'm so grateful for it. And I will always be. And I, I hope that um, people out there just give the support to ICL so that uh, another person, another a student or a teenager can become the leader of, of today and the leader of the future that we require um, here in, in the world.